G'day and welcome back for more Survival Unlikely. Welcome back. Yeah. Come back, this couch is comfy. Couch? Yeah, I'm on your couch. What? You, you can't just steal somebody's couch. I'm not stealing your couch. You said I could sit- well, you didn't actually what? explicitly say oh, no. I could steal. What? I've fallen over and I can't get up. I don't know that you've fallen over as much as you're being examined. What? Oh, that's, mm. <laughs> I wanted to make this look a bit more like an alien abduction. Um, well, you need like a light coming from above. I know, I know. You need a few th few more things to make it work for that. But still. Also aliens. I haven't seen any aliens. Uh, I've just seen evil dudes and robots. Yeah, that's true. I have a mission for you if you choose to accept it. Hold on, I gotta go to the bathroom. There's not much privacy when you're broadcasting. There we go. Alright. Do you choose to accept the mission? Huh? What mission? The mission I'm gonna give you. Uh... What are the details of this mission? No, you you accept or decline before. Well, that doesn't sound right. Alright, I accept. Okay. So what you're going to do... Is you're gonna take this ship... Take ship. You're gonna take your miner once you've... Well, you're gonna finish off your little mining ship. You're gonna take it. Oh yeah, I was doing that. Yeah, you're gonna take it and the bit of pill. You're gonna fly to Europa. You're going to mine as much gold as you can, and then you're going to return here. Uh, fly Europa, mine gold. Wait, weren't we just at Europa? Yeah, a little while ago. Wait, hold. I don't have any shields though. Correct. This doesn't sound like a good idea. It means you run away from baddies. You don't face them. That's one thing when I'm flying the main ship. Well, like, if I'm in the small, like if I'm in the mining ship. Yeah, you keep an eye on your radar. And while you do that, I'm going to build but, a tactical assault ship. Huh, no, that that still doesn't work. Why? Because my mining ship will be underground. Yeah, but you'll be landed on top of the mining. And my ship will deposit. be exposed on the surface, and I'll have to. Notice something is coming, yes. get back up to the surface, connect to the ship, and take off, and outrun whatever's chasing me. So, what I would suggest you do in that instance is you land the miner where it is, jump out, fly up to the agglomerate, uh, fly up to the bitter pill in your suit, and leave. What? No, the... This thing's... Only got atmospheric. The miners only got atmospheric thrusters. I'll have to take the pill down to the planet. Yeah, you'll take it down to Europa, but Europa's got like minimal gravity and minimal sphere of influence. So this thing can fly on Europa because it's Satmo only. But if you put a couple of ions on it as well, just so it can maneuver in space, that'd probably be a smart move. Yeah, yeah, uh, I'm gonna do that. But um, I'm, I'm so basically, what you you're do gonna get me killed? No, I'm not. Hopefully. I think- I think you're ready for this. Well, I'm not ready for it. I haven't even finished building this thing. Okay, I think you are ready to undertake this mission, which includes prepping this miner. I think you can do it. Well, you think a lot of things. Because nothing ever goes wrong when I compliment you. Uh... <laughs> that is an Good outright luck. falsehood. <laughs> Good luck, Kapak. Well... Uh, Right. Now. Uh, hold on, I see I see a red dude. Oh, it's just that vulture. Man, he's been hanging around forever. Yeah, yeah, yes. I don't I'm, like it. I'm thinking what we need on the agglomination are some places to dock ships. Like little landing pads, that sort of thing. What do you oh, think? Oh yeah. Um there are a couple of little refueling spots that I made down the bottom because the cargo ship we attached there suited it? Well, I mean, I made a custom dock for the bitter pill over here. Yeah. Which I think is reasonable, because the bitter pill is kind of... Well, it's... It's special. I suppose I could make a landing pad area for smaller ships that kind of sits over the top of the bitter pill. But that'll make it really hard for you to land. Well, this is meant to be a refueling station, right? Yeah. So we should probably have, like, a big, like, extendable like, uh... Like, docking clamp that can, like, refuel the, the big ships that come in. It well, would have to get, like, we could, clear of the whole we could structure. Make this, we could make this side over here the large ship docking area. Since it sticks out already and it's already piped. 
Sure. Where this um, rocket is, rocket turret. So I'll get rid of the rocket turret and we'll put a connector there. Well, you worry about that. And sure. I'll keep making my little mining ship here. I gotta set up these ejectors. Um, let's see. So I need to set the sorters to do something. So I set them to whitelist stone. stone. And then you set the ejectors to collect all and eject. Uh, if I'm... Oh, hmm. Should I put ice on the whitelist as well? If I'm going to Europa? Uh, yeah, you probably should. But I kind of want some ice to keep it powered and to refuel the... Uh, so what you could do... Is... Oh, can you... No, you can't change that. You're basically just going to have to remember to change that up when you are where you... Like, where you want to eject them or not. Right. Um, because I don't think you want to have a separate ice ejection system, which is basically the only way you'd be able to have a yeah. single button press that deals with it. Uh, although, uh, you no, probably I don't. It, it's it's a lot of extra weight. Yeah. Yeah, I'll, I'll worry about that when it comes to it. Right. Oh, we could actually and make this rear part another landing. Ejectors. Oh, this could be my fighter landing t platform. Check it out. Over here. Uh, where's he? Over... Oh, yeah. I could land my multi-use fighter there. Because I have a plan for it now. I have an idea of how I want to do it. Ow. That was my face. Uh, so I need some ions. You don't need much, you just need enough to maneuver in space for docking. Yeah. Purposes. I think that's pretty much it then. It should be good to go, I think. Cool. Might just do a few little decorations. And make sure you got your jump drive set up and everything like that. Uh, Splitzy. Yeah? Uh, I think I see some more orcs. Oh, and uh, rather close too. Uh, yeah. I think they're trying to sneak up on us. Uh, alright. Let's face our guns towards them then. Whoa. Uh, they don't like me. Oh, did you go in already? I'm just at the asteroid. They're real close. Yeah, I know. I just thought you didn't realize you'd already run in. I was trying to roll the uh, bit of pill so it wasn't facing it. Oops, well, that's not rolling the correct way. The asteroid's soaking up some oh. of their fire. Uh-oh, and some of the missiles. That was a lot of missiles. Oh. Uh, do you want to come back and turn off the inertial dampers Ow. for the bit of pill, please? Whoa. It's fighting any manoeuvring I do. Uh, Most of our guns are on top, so I'm trying to keep our top towards it. Dampeners are off. Okay, thank you. Alright, here we go. Take that, shoot a boat. Oh, incoming missiles. There we go, that made some of them miss the shield at least. Ow. Is it shooting back anymore? I uh, can't see. It's not shooting back with much, is it? No, it looks like it's got a few anti-personnel turrets left. Our shields can probably stand up to that though, can't they? Yeah, they should do. It's just as long as those missile launchers are dead. I mean, they're not firing. Alright, I don't... Uh, oh, oh, for health. Yeah, there's another turret around the back of it from where you are. Right, I've turned off the turrets. I'm hopping out. I'm coming back to get some heals. Okay. So I got four health. Good job. Oh, better than zero health. Ah! Ow! Emergency! Emergency! What? There's an emergency going on. What? What? 
But I mean, I thought it was pretty obvious. No, I th who are you calling out emergency to? Anyone who's listening. Ow, it's really hard to hit this turret. Ow. Right. That's not good. I boarded the enemy vessel. Oh man, there are a lot of things bouncing around on the ship. <gasps> Come back, I think your miner's getting shot up. What? Ow! Ow, it just ran into me. <laughs> Have you managed to board it? Uh, well, it took out its gun. Okay, good. I'm just getting my body back. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. What? Whoa, it's- it's spinning real fast and I'm dead. Oh, is it doing that thing again? We're gonna have to take out its control. Oh no, where's my body? My precious body. Yep, it's throwing a fit. <sighs> Sometimes it's so hard to lock onto your bag properly. Uh, speaking of which... Have you lost yours again? It is apparently sailing off into space at maximum speed. Right. Again. Grrr. It's a little bit of platinum every time that happens. How did I know that the orcs were going to will it blend me again? It's got some stuff we want. Oh yeah, it does. It's got an LCD with a skull and crossbones on it. There's no artificial gravity here. We could mag boot to it. There we go. Now it can't flick me off. Are you sure? Uh, moderately so. <laughs> well, I don't have any tools to salvage it. Where's the ship gone? I'm inside it. Uh, just deactivate these batteries for what it's worth. Sure. I'll try to find some tools. I don't know what it's doing on the outside. Oh, hello. Okay, that's where I am. Uh... No, why can't I get these bottles? Why can't you what? You can get these ones. Uh, have I broken some of the cargo network again? I uh, don't know. I'm guessing it hasn't stopped spinning yet. Nope. Um, well, it seems to start up again whenever I get close. I'd say it's probably given up on trying to track me. The last one had a whole lot of gyros on it. It took ages to find them all. Yeah. So I went straight away looking for the... Aha! I found a sprain! Can't reach it though. Whoa. Whoa, it is moving way too fast for me to move. Yep, it just flipped me out. Oh, hang on. I have an idea. I know how I can make this work. Uh, it's up there. I need to place down that, and then I can walk up that slope and get the height I need. Oh. Okay, now I fit. There we go. Brain gone. Yeah. Alrighty. <gasps> it's got an intact jump drive! Uh huh. What does that mean? We just got a thousand superconductor components. We could build a large reactor on the agglomination. Large reactor, you say? Yeah. Uh, do you want to do your trick and bring that bit of pill over? Or should I just bring the whole thing? Uh, I mean, it's out here anyway. May as well drag the whole thing over. Yeah, I think there's something loose in the ship. Does sound like it. Whoops. Oh. What was that? Just a little nudge. Just a little nudge. Yeah, I hit a little bit of the shooter boat. 
Yay, time for fun. Grinding time. We need a grinding ship. Something like it. Uh, you could convert your miner into a grinding ship. If we're going to use this thing for mining instead. Uh, not really. It was designed around having um, no easy cargo port for that sort of thing. Because yeah. you need the large cargo ports to the front for that to work. I reckon it's going to be fun when we can get our shield on the Benefil and I've got my... Once I build this fighter I'm planning on building. Flying around, doing our piracy thing, bringing goods back in. Flying down to the planet, doing some uranium mining. Piracy. Selling it for profit. What? You still think you're not the pirate here? What? Well, they're the pirates. They keep trying to blow us up. And then what do we do? We exact our revenge. Our fully justified revenge. Uh huh. Man, you're making a lot of weird noises over there. I'm not making any noises. You're making noises. I didn't make a noise. I'm just making tiny little weldy noises. Why are you making weldy noises? I'm building a mining ship. Oh, you're leaving the grinding all down, down to me. Okay, gotcha. Oh, I didn't know we were there yet. Yeah, that was what that boom was when I hit it. Inventory. I thought that was just a piece of debris. No, that was the ship itself. Um, I'll get the jump drive if you can get that ion thrusters. I mean, we could agglomerate this, but I kind of don't want to. I don't want to bespoil the agglomeration with orc filth. What? Are you some kind of orc hater? <laughs> well, they're calling us scum. So the reason I was thinking it'd be great to build a, um, a large reactor is that will seriously boost the power of the shields. Do we have enough uraniums? Um, I think it's just as fuel efficient or inefficient as a little one. I've never actually tested. Uh, so yes, I guess. But we're over the alien planet, so we can always go get more. But it'll be good if we don't have to fly the agglomeration <laughs> around to dodge missiles. Because we can just stand up to them. Yeah, that's true. Um, hmm. Could we make some, like, point defense guns that'll shoot down missiles? Yeah, we probably could. We used to have them on the cockroach. Remember the cockroach? The what? Yeah, I thought so. What happened to the cockroach? I left the door open, it got stolen. Oh yeah! We haven't seen the guy, but we've seen some evidence of his passing since. You need one of those, um, you know, like a club lock that you can put in a steering wheel. Yeah. Oh boy. Sometimes grinding this stuff down is a pain, even though we sometimes get some awesome stuff. Uh oh. What? There's a Tesla drone. Oh great, that's, that's bad. Um, we're gonna have to, because it's gonna attack this Hulk, we need to get the goodies off it as quick as possible. Uh... I think it'll attack both us and this wreck. Um, and I'm gonna have to n turn the turrets on, aren't I? Probably. Alright, I think I've got all the good bits out of this jump drive. Yes, I, got, I do. I got the four ion thrusters at the back. Focus on the reactors next. Reactors? Yeah, there are reactors inside. I'm gonna head up to the bridge so that I can turn the turrets on. Actually, I can do it from down here. Oh, I should be flying. Uh, oh, it's here. Yeah, I'm almost in the seat. It's shooting lightning bolts. It's trying to Emperor Palpatine us. How about now? Are we shooting back? No, it's shooting the, the orc ship. Uh, I think I've got the drone's attention, like. No, I don't have control over which turrets are active. Stopped firing. Alright, I have another plan. I've taken out its missile turret. Good job. Charge! What? What are you doing? It's got a message written on it. What does that say? Oh, what? How'd I miss? I can't read it. It's spinning around too quickly. Oh, I missed. What happens next will shock you. Oh, really? That's what it says. 
Wow. Are you still at it? Yeah, it's disabled. Oh. It's not even moving. I was gonna ram it, but I ended up just flying straight past. Well, it's got a bunch of small ion thrusters on it that we could salvage. Alright, I'm returning. Wait, what were you trying to ram it with? The agglomination. What, the whole thing? Yeah. You just... You just tried to ram a... small fighter craft with its space station. <laughs> yeah. That is irresponsible. Well, the space station has shields. The space station can handle it. Uh, tell me when I'm close and I should start slowing down. Yeah, it'll probably start slowing down. I already have. Um, you want to park that thing? Uh, it's slowly parking. You may have to do a bit of flying. I mean, it's small grid, you could bump it back. Well, I tried to, but it doesn't seem to be... Oh, has it still anything. got inertial dampeners on or something? No. But I don't think I got enough... ...mass. Oh, we'll at be least. able to set this orc ship nope. adrift too. Not without killing myself, at least. You know, I don't see anything on this that could shoot giant lightning bolts. Huh. Maybe the whole thing does. Maybe the whole thing is the weapon. Hmm. It's possible. Damn Tesla and his machines. Only one way to teach a guy like that. That's to electrocute an elephant. Yeah, I'm not touching that. <laughs> no idea what you're on about. That's what Thomas Edison did. He was all like, you're wrong, Tesla. Your electricity is more dangerous than mine. See what it does to this elephant. Is that true? Yep. Yeah, he went on like a like a tour where he went around electrocuting animals to prove prove the dangers of electricity to people. But yeah, that, that was part of the AC versus DC thing, wasn't it? Yes. I can't remember which one of them was on which side. Eh, uh, me neither. But, regardless, both are dangerous. Yes. In the tens of thousands of volts range. Because didn't, didn't one of them convince the authorities in the US to use DC as the... for the electric chair? To try and dissuade people from using it? Because uh. it was to prove just how deadly it was. Yeah, I do do recall some. I feel like I like learned that. about that from a reasonable source, so I think it's accurate. But I'm not. It's the sort of thing that you're never sure about with that stuff. How much of it's untrue? Just rumor. Alrighty. Well. Given how much they were all trying to spread lies about each other, anyway. Oh, this thing doesn't have much power left. What doesn't have much power left? Is two batteries going to be enough? For what? my mining ship. Um, your mining ship is going to charge off the bit of pill. Yeah, that's true. How many reactors do you have on the bit of pill, by the way? On the bit of pill? I think it's just got the one nuclear reactor. Why don't you add a second... a bunch of batteries in the Why don't the you add a second panels. small reactor to it? Uh, I might do. Like, before you leave. Because you're going to need to charge up your jump drive, so you're going to need a lot of juice. You've got batteries on it as well, though, don't you? Yes. Yeah. I, th I still think it'd be worthwhile. Connectors. Although, since you're going to Europa, you could always you could always put a hydrogen engine on there. There we go. My mining ship is locked on and ready to go. Nice. You gonna add that reactor like I suggested, or are you just gonna chance it? Uh, I might throw another reactor in. Good call. Uh, where am I gonna put it? Because we got enough parts. We've probably got enough uranium to for you to take a decent amount. Um, where am I going to put it? Kind of had everything sorted. I guess I could put it in the engineering bay. There's a bit of space. I'm going to put a welding more on the front of the agglomination. I'm going to grinding more. A what a who's it? I'm going to put a bunch of grinders on the front of the agglomination so that I can grind stuff like this ship up and spit it out. Aha. Uh -huh. Sort of. Oops. I just typed uraniums because you said it. <laughs> um, I reckon you could take 
Oh, you've put 50 in each of your reactors? Do I have put anything in the new one yet? Uh, it's piped up. It's already grabbed some. Yours are the orange ones that are connected, and they've both got 50 kilos in them. Well, the system must be working then. Yeah. Unless it's not connected at all. Oh, you are connected. No, you're not. You are not hooked up at all. What? That doesn't make sense. Your, your hookup is broken. It got damaged. But how did it get uraniums? Uh, must have, you must have had some in your storage or something. There we go. Now you're hooked up to the system. Uh oh. More orcs coming. Oh man. Uh, that's a savage gunship. That could be bad. Uh, I'm going to vacate the area. Is it coming? Is it coming after us or is it just flying near us? 3.77, 3.76. Looks like it's getting closer, but we're also moving around, so it's hard to tell. Well, I was trying to put the bit of pill on the far side so that you are protected by the agglomination. Uh, it could be heading for that pirate vulture. Yeah. It does seem to be traveling laterally. It does. I think we might be okay. Uh, so you wanted me to go find gold? Yeah, I want you to jump to Europa and mine gold and then come back. Hmm. We need gold. Sounds like a lot of work. Well, you chose to accept the mission. I gave you a choice. Oh, I haven't set up the thrusters on that yet. Uh, you should really be naming your groups based on the ship as well, so that we can know what group is what. Yep, that's what I'm doing. Good. Because we've been both really bad at that. Check this out. Grinder time. Oh, jeez. You're going to kill us all. Should allow us to get a lot more of the goodies from the orc ship without having to spend so much time on it. Oh right, I need to modulate the shields first. <laughs> yeah. Yep. Okay. That's all good to go. Alright. Um, <laughs> you okay over there? I'm hearing a lot of muttering. <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to make sure I'm ready to go on a mining expedition. Uh huh. Uh, you said I need to do something with the jump drive? Yeah, you need to make sure you've got it set up so you can use it. Uh. How? So you can increase and decrease the range. It's and at 507 kilometers. Yeah, so have a control on your hotbar to increase, decrease the range, and a control on your hotbar to jump. What you're also going to want to have, if you can, is a camera so you can lock on to, so you can aim better with your jump drive. Uh, camera. I don't really have... I mean, do you have to make all the terrifying noises? <laughs> yes, I do. Let me know when you're ready to go, because I want to watch you leave. What the... Hmm. Oh, you look right. Sorry? It's kind of loud here. I said it doesn't look right! Messed up the front of the ship. What? That's it. I'm out of here. You're actually leaving? Yes. Oh, okay. Whoa. Uh, I'm trying to at least. What's wrong with what I did to the front of the illumination? Uh, it's a mess. Is was that intentional? What? It's smacking the orc ship like a giant space baseball bat. No. I couldn't see it. I'm gonna get out of here before you destroy us all. Alright, I'll come down to, um... Jump. Come down to your... Jump drive dock. two? Wait, why am I only seeing one jump drive? Because there is only one jump drive. Isn't there one on the agglomination? No. You've got the only jump drive. Great. So, increase distance... So don't lose it. Decrease distance... And... Jump. Hey, get back. Can you go into first person? Uh. Can you see me? See you. Yeah. I'm waving at you. Are you over at that door over there? I oh, think I could. Window. Just make you out. Uh, how about now? Better? Slightly. You're still quite far away. Oh, yeah, I'm far away. I'm, I want to watch you jump. 
Uh, okay. Um, hazard lights. Yep. <laughs> nice, stylish. And I will... Disconnect your connector. Disconnect. And move away from the dock. Yep. This looks cool from here. And then align to Mars. To Mars? Yeah, to Mars, because Europa's near Mars. Can you see it at all? I don't know if we can from here. Uh... You may have to jump is a that, bit away from the alien planet to find that, it. Yep, but no, that must be the alien planet. The alien see, planet's the massive one. I see. Oh, hold on. I think that's Mars over there. There's too many... Yep, okay. I see it. Are you lined up to it? Uh, switching to targeting computer. It is 3,000 kilometers away. All right. Jump away. Blam! <laughs> that was so cool! It gets the backdrop of the alien planet. That looks amazing. Oh, good luck, Kavak. Hopefully I see you soon. I mean, hopefully I don't see you soon. Because if I see you soon, you've lost your med bay. Uh, don't lose your med bay. Oh, good. <laughs> Wait. I don't have a... No, I do have a med bay. Okay, that's all right. <laughs> that could have been really awkward. <laughs> If I died and ended up with you. Uh... Right, I'm heading for the ice planet. Oh no. Where'd my... Oh, there it is. Oh, I can turn off my hazard lights now that I'm in deep space. Yeah. Are you excited to go on your first real solo mission since the moon? No, I'm gonna get exploded. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, You've learned so much since then. You'll be fine. Oops. Uh, how can I tell when my jump drive is ready? Um, so on your hotbar, is it currently saying five kilometers? As the distance readout for your distance adjustments? Uh, it says 100% and then there's the five. Yeah. Or maybe it's a 15? Uh, it'll be a five. So you could try and press jump, and it'll tell you how long it's got. Yeah, I know that. But is there some way to display it? Uh, to display it without using a script for an LCD? No. Maybe we'll want to look into one. Because then you could have a nice little display. Somewhere on your little control seat. Control seat... Oh, there's no way to do it without a script. Oh. Well, this is going to take a while. I think it'll take you, like, how long is it saying it's... Until you're charged. Uh, you should be almost at the full charge rate. Like seven minutes? Forty-five percent. Forty-five minutes? What? No, forty-five percent! Oh, how long till it's fully charged though? I don't know. If you go into the control panel and look at the jump drive, it'll tell you. Jump drive two. Four minutes. Yeah. Is it based on your, your power output? Yeah, so it can take 32 megawatts in at any time. Right, so I might actually rotate so my solar panels are in the sun and I'll fix sure. it a little bit. That'll, it's more going to be grabbing all of the power from your batteries. Well, yeah, but every little bit helps. And you may want to set your miners' batteries to recharge. Uh, I think they are. Yes, they're recharging. Okay. Yellow is recharging, right? Oh, cool. We'll still be able to use these grinders even once we... Um, lock down the agglomination properly. Okay. Well, if we build a tug craft, then we can tug the wrecks into the moor. Oh, yeah? It'll actually probably work even better than having the agglomination move around and chase these things. 97.09 98.61 Again there. 99.37 <laughs> No fuel. Jump number two. Don't jump too far. Yeah, it's going to take a while before I have to worry about jumping too far. Um, no, you're jumping a 1200, uh, like a 2000 Ks each time, aren't you? Because you're not very heavy. Jump drive. Distance 5 kilometers. Yeah, because you're now out of power again. Oh. Uh, 
I thought it was like 500 kilometers. No, it was 500 for the agglomeration. You should be heaps more than that. Oh well. Max range. We shall see. Uh, Splitzy. Yeah, come back. I think I forgot something. What did you forget? I think I forgot to put a gravity generator on the ship. Oh, jeez, I thought it was going to be something bad, like ammunition. Ah, I can't get back in my chair. Here we go. Alright, I'm, I'm kind of bored of grinding down this orc thing, so I think I'm going to give up on it shortly. Uh, ammunition, you see. Alright, there we go. Wait. Okay. Tossed off into the distance. Where's Mars gone? Oh, where's our asteroid gone? Oh, over there. Wait, is that? Huh? Oh, I'm so confused. <laughs> Are you looking at Titan or Mars? Wait, that looks like Earth. Did you jump towards Earth? Maybe. Earth and Mars are in a similar direction from the, uh... from the alien planet. Uh... Wait, is Europa the moon of Mars? Yes. Right, okay. I'm... sort of headed the right way. Okay. Filling me with confidence there, Kapak. So I had a thought with my, um, my multi-use vehicle craft. Oh yeah? I thought what I'd do was, um, make it so that it had a detachable cargo segment. So that if we need to fight, we just can detach that and fight with a lighter craft that's more nimble. But when we want to go down to the planet, we can take the cargo segment and the cargo segment should also have, like, parachutes on it so that we could drop it and all that sort of thing if we needed to in a desperation move. That sure. sort of thing. Does that sound interesting? Doable? Something you'd be interested in? Uh, co-piloting? Hmm. Do you have an answer to that? <laughs> but, so, um... So you want to make, like, a separate... What, what is this cargo going to be for? Uh, for... Transiting ores from planets to the bitter pill. Okay. Ores or ingots. Well, ingots more. So that we're, it'll it'll go down. To, this ship will go down to Mars, collect the platinum, so you don't have to fly all the way down in the bitter pill. Because the bitter pill without wheels now is quite inefficient to land. Right. And then, like on Europa, I could go down, or I could fly escort to your mining ship, that sort of thing. So it, I, I wanted it to be multi-role. So like a mobile drill rig, but it's got like a modular, like detachable cargo container, so it can. No, no drill rig. What? How we? Uh, okay, so we're going to use the miners. Yeah. So we have a mining platform that lands, mm -hmm. and then the mining drones or the mining things can fly up to it and connect to it and drop off their stuff. But it's got like a main cargo section that can detach and take off and deliver the stuff and then come back down to the platform. I suppose we could do that too. That wasn't what my plan was, but you'll see. You'll see once you get back. You'll see what I what I was thinking. Um, and it'll make a lot more sense. Yeah, because that way you could have cargo on the platform that the mining ships load up while the the cargo shuttle's not there. The cargo yeah. shuttle comes down, loads yeah, whatever's yeah. in the cargo yes. containers. And this shuttle and will also back. be heavily armed so that if it needs to, it can fight. Sure. It'll be a fighter, dual roll sort of thing. It'll be pretty big. Like, this thing is going to be a very large, small grid ship. Oh, man, I'm getting hungry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going to get you a sandwich. I promise. Do I have some food here somewhere? I'm going to get you the most epic of sandwiches. What? How are you going to deliver it to me? I'm on my way to another planet. When you get back. Surely i got something around here. Oh. What's oh? My hologram has uh, again been cut in half by a magician and is freaking out. Yeah. Ah! And the sofa just threw me across the room. What is going on over there? I'm trying to get a snack from the kitchen. How do I use this thing? Oh, that's a bad idea. Is there something in here? Uh, I can't open these drawers. Uh, maybe there's something I can microwave. Oh, the cargo's pretty much empty. Ah, uh, yeah, because the inventory manager's on on the agglomination, so it would have taken everything from you. Hmm. Don't even need to record a video, I could just put a screenshot. <laughs> <laughs> I, I reckon you'd notice. Hmm. There's probably something, like because of the changing direction of the sun, that sort of thing. 
Oh well, eventually, yeah, but <laughs> not not quickly, no. Oh, all these unknown I'm signals I'm missing. So go get them. Can't. Why not? I get left behind. Your ship can't jump without you. It actually cannot do it. No, but it can travel at high speed. So slow down and stop. I don't want to. I'll get mashed by orcs. Oh, you'll be fine. Get your unknown signals. You've got a ship that can jump even to the strong ones. Yeah, but I haven't seen any of those. Yeah, there was one over near me when you after you left. Oh, of course there was. <laughs> yep. Typical. No. Jump drive seems to be charging in... 0.38% increments. Oh, I almost got lucky sevens. Come on, all lucky sevens. There's only one there. No! I missed it by 4%. 0.4%. 0.04%. Make up your mind. My day is ruined. Can I jump yet? Nope. Yeah. I need a TV like or something. Before. You could make yourself a TV. Or a PlayStation 4, then I can play the Final Fantasy 7 no more. <laughs> uh, Capac. So topical because I know exactly that it's exactly that that you're hoping to do right now. I'm making you play this. Energy. For those of you wondering, the demo came out last night, so this morning I went and got a PlayStation 4, and it's all set up and ready to go, but I gotta do all this recording for you guys! That's how much you're worth to him. Mm-hmm. But it's making me itch knowing that it's like... So close and yet so far. Yep, especially as we've got more recording to do after we finish this. Yep. <laughs> That's okay. I can I can offload all those emotions on Dean now by shooting them in the face. Yes. How much of this I'll actually leave in this <laughs> I can only wait and see. Right, surely you're charged now. No! 96%. You wanna try and make this thing independently pilotable? I don't like remote control. Yeah, just in case. At least for low grav. High grav, I think it'll just be too much work to make it capable of carrying its mass. I mean... Oh. Hmm. Hmm? Yeah, probably... Oh, but won't things be attracted to the antennas? Uh, yes. Uh -huh. The Reavers would be, if there were any Reavers around. Orc death ship. Ooh. Get out of here. How close are you to jumping? Um, pretty close. I suppose the other nice thing about trying to make this independently movable is that whenever I'm flying with it attached, I'll have a bit more thrust, a bit more lift. Ah. To counter the added weight of it. Because mm -hmm. I'm going to be merge blocking to it, so... Um, I'll have full control over its systems. 95%! Uh oh. He's wagging at me. Get out of here, orcs! So are you planning on, um, leaving the bitter pill in orbit, or are you taking it right down to the surface? Uh, how much atmosphere does Europa have? Not much. Enough that your atmospheric thrusters will work, uh, but not enough that your parachutes will save you. What parachutes? Oh, you don't have... You were going to put parachutes on there. Yeah, I forgot. <laughs> I suppose it's like the grav drive. Grav gen? Yep. Oh, I'm kind of tempted to make this have a um, small grid inter... like proper cockpit that you can walk in. Make oh, yeah. Big enough for that. With a nice little airtight hanging door on the back if I can make it small enough. Maybe on top. On top would probably work better because then I could just use oh. a piston. Oh, that didn't look good. What happened? Oh. I can see something on the surface and it just came up with a... some kind of hostile... red marker thing. Oh yeah, there might be some enemy bases around there from when we were last there. There's definitely something, but I don't know if it's like a boulder or if it's an enemy base. If it's a crashed ship. Could investigate. That doesn't sound like a good idea. Oh, sure it does. You'll be fine. What's the worst that could happen? Um, well. 
Hold on, I'm gonna need a notepad and a pen. <laughs> yep, hiding pirate station. That's right. What? Ah! There's a light patrol drone! No. Oh. What ah, type? Weapons on! The type that's a kilometer behind me. Corrupt. Ravers. Uh, SPRT. Oh. oh. It's disappeared. Oh, I see fire. It might be that wreck we left here. Oh, is that where your markers are? Do I need to send you the gold? Do I still have the well, gold? Well, I wasn't even going for one of my markers. I just happened to have ended up this way. Um, well, there's gold in them thar hills. Oh, jeez, I forgot I'm even meant to be looking for gold. Ore detector, range, maximum. What? It's only 150 meters. Yeah. Well, you got plenty of fuel there available to you, so you can just hover using your hydro. Um, did you have any markers for gold? I just sent you one. Uh, them thar hills. What? Because there's gold in them thar hills. That's my marker. I've already got it. Oh, no, I made that marker! What? Well, I don't know. I've already got it. Then go to it. Oh, there's my trench. I am three kilometers out from them thar hills. Oh! Oh, I just saw something. Oh, I've got signals for gold and silver. Nice. Well, since our asteroid over here has silver, just focus on the gold. We'll see if I can... On there, and just for now, because I don't know which side I want to put it on. Two. Then we can kind of pop... I'm imagining popping down through an airtight hole, hole in the roof. Park in this little have... ravine. So I hopefully get a bit of cover. So you're you're ready to start your mining run? Uh, yeah. Cool. Well, I've laid down some ideas for my new combat and cargo ship. So hopefully next time I will get some more work done on that. Capac's going to collect a whole bunch of gold and hopefully not die while he's doing it. So there's all that and plenty more to come. And we will see you then. See you later, everybody. Good luck, Capac. You're gonna need it. Grr.